Welcome back to Shadow the Edgehog 2. That is what we're going with then, right? Yeah, I mean, why not? No, okay. I'm already, I scrubbed out the H out of the logo anyway, so it really is Shadow the Edgehog. <laughs> oh crap, I didn't even notice. I'm gonna have to go back and look. Yep. So this is Shadow just kind of musing about what he's done in the past uh, 24 hours, I guess. Is there a recap every single time? Uh, every single time that I decide to start back. But yeah, there's gonna be a recap every single time. <laughs> okay. But don't worry, it doesn't start from the beginning every single time. That would be that would be completely acid. <laughs> the opening gets longer and longer as you keep going on. So as you know, I started here and then. Oh, seven. Shadow, stop! Uh, it's like, oh God, it's ten minutes. I just want to play the game. Dear Lord, dude. Oh, and there's no skip button. Shit. Actually, there is. So. Oh, okay, good. But why would we want to skip this amazing cutscene oh, of a man. somber moment with the President of the United States? United Federation, sorry. His head looks weird. It's like Every president's head looks weird. Here, here, think of it this way. Uh, it's like somebody was able to fit like a Pringles tube over his head and it came out to that shape. Tell the commanding generals that so the check this. Federation yes. will never surrender to terrorists. Black aliens are attacking his country. Mm -hmm. Casualties everywhere. The mm -hmm. entire city is crumbling beneath him. Was once War is crazy. He's apparently got a, a love crush on two hedgehogs <laughs> to keep that photo on his desk. <laughs> and yet still has higher approval ratings than Trump. We must <laughs> <laughs> Especially with the hedgehog love, he definitely got a lot of people on his side after that. It's not as weird as getting pissed on by Russian prostitutes. <laughs> That's a very good point. I don't care if it happened or not. In my mind, it did. It did. <laughs> oh, hey, we're, we're going to prison. Yeah, we're going to Prison Island. So, alright. Um, about half of the missions in this game aren't too bad. The other half are teeth-grindingly annoying. Is this one of those teeth-grindingly annoying ones? It would be if we were doing uh, something else. Emeralds around here. But oh. uh, we're doing doing neutral routes, so it's it's gonna be fine. Oh, all right. Ah, uh, flashbacks. Ah, uh, this somehow hurts my head. What? Memories are hitting me That's like right. a brick to the head. I somehow escaped. They're hitting me like a slideshow. But was then captured by those humans. But from where? I hate and PowerPoint why? presentations. Gah! <laughs> it's such an inefficient system. <laughs> wow, Alcatraz has gone over some uh, some renovations here. Extreme Alcatraz. <laughs> the most extreme Alcatraz. You put up the horns. Woo! Extreme. Oh, oh my God! 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 No! 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 I thought I destroyed you. You should be dead, Charmy! Please! God, no! <laughs> oh, why are there so many Sonic sidekicks? I've asked you this many, many times! Well, okay, why? Okay. Admittedly, this is a game where all of the wonderful Sonic sidekicks just cram all into one. But then again, you could say the, then again, you could say the same thing for Sonic Heroes, where they literally were cramming into the screen all the... <laughs> They were literally shoulder to shoulder, elbow to elbow on the screen, trying to make up time, make up, uh, take up the spotlight. Well, the gimmick for this one is uh, acid rivers and using this thing to skate on them. It's kind of cool, if uh, a little bit inefficient, but still handles better than Sonic Racers or Sonic R or any of the other Sonic racing games because they're so, all terrible. Is this how they transport the prisoners to the different cells? It's like if they want to go down to the dining hall, like the only ones who are good at surfboarding survive and make it to breakfast. Yeah, most of them have to take an escort. Let me tell you, they may say how much they hate cops and they're going to stab the next pig that dares come within 50 feet of them, but when they got to go to the Acid River to go get lunch, oh, they cling on to that cop like there ain't no tomorrow. I'll tell you what, son. <laughs> Is this the warden talking, talking to the new recruits? And then somebody <laughs> says, Acid Bath? Oh, wait, no. Acid River? What do you mean? He's like, you, you haven't been here before, have you, boy? Oh, check this out. Whoa! That was cool. See, so, yeah, they keep acid in their base. Just because? Yeah, that's a little chemistry joke for you all. Oh! I got it. There you it, go. It, it went by too fast. Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. What the? Oops. 
<laughs> oh crap! <laughs> I uh, I left the slider thing on the spring and uh, yeah. Oops. Shadow, you're I'm breaking the laws of physics. I'm not gonna say this is a perfect game. Let's just get that <laughs> right off the bat, okay? Uh, I I think people knew that when they looked at the title of the episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! There we go. Okay. This looks familiar. Are they reusing assets? I mean, not assets, but like locations. What do you mean? Like, I swear I've seen this already in the first part of the level. Just they just added a bad guy or two or three. Well, maybe they did. I mean, just like location-wise, like I've already seen cells to the left, cells to the right with death on either side, either opposing side. I would guess it's to disorient the player, it's like, oh, are you going backwards or forwards? Which checkpoint were you at before? Which one are you at now? Ho 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 ho! You know, that, that sort of thing. And then Shadow gets arrested. <laughs> See, I'm still thinking this is somebody's, like, fanfiction OC kind of thing. I got ten different fanfictions then. <laughs> Yes, again, exactly. Is it weird that I don't see Shadow with a gun? Is that weird? Like, they see that, oh, this is sacrilege. How do you have Sonic with a gun? It's like, doesn't seem that strange to me. M maybe I'm just not in touch with the mythos. In fact, I know I'm not in touch with it. But uh, taking a look at this, knowing what I know about Sonic or didn't know, uh, it looked really stupid to have a little cartoon animal with a gun. Yeah, it's really stupid to have a little cartoon animal with a gun. Uh-huh. Here's about five games that have <laughs> little cartoon animals with guns, and nobody gave them shit for that. Oh, shit. I yeah, Fur like Fighters! That's a good one! Remember that fucking shit? No. I do. I was just thinking Concrete Bad Fur Day. I've already played that shit. So again, it's, it's, it's not that weird. Not to me, at least. I, I'm wanting to think that the thought process behind that is an E10 game having that. Unless well, Fur Fighters is the exact same thing, then my point is moot. Well, Fur Fighters is a bit more crass than Shadow the Hedgehog. Shadow the Hedgehog... Shadow's here just a bit more edgy, but uh, Fur Fighters was uh, definitely crasser. Uh, yeah. I guess. If you want to talk crass, talk about the drunken squirrel that, that rare houses. Okay, not as crass as that. Fur Fighters was rated T, Conquer was rated M, so... <laughs> I'm... <laughs> It shouldn't have been rated M. <laughs> if you want, if you want total honesty, it should not have been rated M. That game is bad for everybody. But it's still AO then. Uh, pretty close. <laughs> Please, I grew up at Newgrounds. You know, <laughs> bad fur days, fucking nothing. Okay. Okay, so you're null to it. Yeah, you know, uh, just uh. I need to find the chaos. Yes, I, I do know about the D-pad, but I've already recorded episodes before I figured out about that. So you're going to see me doing the D-pad in episode 4 onward. But anyway, yeah. Okay. It's nothing shocks you when you see Bomberman take a shit in the toilet. It, you the know, fourth just... <laughs> what? Are we still talking about Newgrounds, then? Yes. That's a thing that happened? Yeah, it's a thing that happened. It's called Good Bomberman... B. It's called Bomberman Poops. <laughs> It's like Professor Layton in the malignant growth. <laughs> it's just... Newgrounds is like the perversion of everything I like. It's like, uh, Mr. Layton, uh, I'm afraid that your cancer has become terminal. Every puzzle has an answer. No, 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 it's, no. it's an operable stage 4 cancer. Critical thinking is the key to... You're going to die. Oh. Well... Somebody give me a crossword puzzle. I can't deal with this. <laughs> oh, we're uh, on the uh, edgy version of the Super Mario 3 airships stage. Dun, 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 I like how Black Tomb's just here. <laughs> like we like we, we just seen him with his eye and his you know holograms, but now he's just oh, he's here. It's like, hey Shadow, what's up? Yeah, I love how he's being somewhat casual, and he only came to Shadow. Like, he didn't try to find some other hedgy, uh, edgy animal, excuse me, and trying to think, hey, you want to help me take over the world, destroy all these humans, huh? I like to think he talked to Espio first. What the hell is an Espio? Espio the Chameleon, that purple dude from Chaotix. You who, you who so claim to love Sonic Heroes so much. I never claim that. I think it's just as stupid. Okay, good. I'm glad we're in agreement there. I didn't know there was a chameleon. 
Really? Yeah. Team Chaotix. It was Vector, Charmy, and get get ready. Espio. Oh. This is Sky Troops. This is an airship stage. It's oh, be. good. This blue sky staring at it. <laughs> Reciting poetry, <laughs> eh, Shadow? Where have I seen a blue sky before? <laughs> <laughs> He's looking through like his his travel guide, just going, Blue sky. Haven't seen one of those in a long time. Oh, that's right. Breaking Bad. <laughs> Do you think Shadow would watch Breaking Bad? Just as an aside, do you, what show do you think Shadow would find entertaining? Uh, let's see. Uh, maybe Probably. Game of Thrones because people die? Nah, that's a bit too out there for him. I would probably say something like Charmed. Hmm, I can see that. Because it's completely moronic. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for your reason, and I'm glad you came through. So here's what Black Doom wants us to do. He wants us to take this turret and shoot down all of Eggman's ships, but that's what? taking a long, long time. Okay, there we go. But, uh, that's just taking too long. Let's go, again, find the emerald and fuck off. So, Black Doom... Like, hey, Eggman. oh, and Eggman's the, the supposed good side. So, I'm, I'm wondering, Black Doom okay. and nobody's What kind of friend? fucked up game is this where, where uh, Robotnik is the good guy in this one, huh? Uh, I never heard that before. <clears throat> never. Nope. Nope, never. Eggman was on the dark side of Soccer Mmm, he became kind of a good guy in the end. Well, then there's, uh, Sonic Chronicles. Yeah. Have you ever- have you ever played Sonic Chronicles? No, I've only- I've only gone by what you've said. I don't know if I've gone on record in saying this, but I'm gonna go on record and say it again. It's one of the- it's probably the most garbage Sonic game I've ever played in my entire fucking life. Holy shit, that's a- that's a tall order, my friend. Like, yeah. really tall order. Worse than Sonic 06, and, well, okay, just as bad as Sonic Boom, we'll put it that way. Ouch! Made my Bioware of all people! What did it do to you? Where did it touch you? Like, point to- point on the doll where Sonic Chronicles touched you in the bad way. And I just- I just, uh, collapse my hands around the entire doll. <laughs> crumple it up- the, crumple the doll into a ball. It touched me everywhere. But no, it is, it's is—it's got a ridiculous storyline. I mean, Eggman, Eggman is evil, then he turns good, and then at the very end, he turns evil for a cliffhanger ending, spoilers, for a game that's never going to come to fruition. Ooh, good. There's never going to be a sequel to Sonic Chronicles. They thought it was going to be. They thought it was going to be like you know, a massive three-part series. People thought it was going to be like... Uh, Super Mario RPG and how good it was, because, you know, Mario's had good RPG, Sonic's gotta be good too, but no, but it's fucking shit! Fucking garbage! Oh, man. I mean, when you win a battle, you hear the sound of children cheering! It's like, what kind of... what kind of eight-year-old would like this? <laughs> so it's just, like, small little nagging annoyances that eventually build up into something, like, really dumb. Yeah, and then you realize you're not having a good time, and even with action replay, yes, I have it for the DS too. <laughs> <laughs> it just, it just hurts all over. Mm. <sighs> Sorry to hear that, my friend. Uh, so, back to this game. Oh, that's uh, a big ramp. Do it, do it. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Yeah, all right, yeah. and woo! There we all go. Right, yay, we! The whole reason Sonic games are good: going fast and going on loop de loops. You know, Sonic Chronicles, Sonic Chronicles has loop-de-loops, and they suck. Because it's in, in like, a big 3D play. I, I forget what Sonic Chronicles looks like. I might have to look that up afterwards, either that or get the game yourself. It's, uh, 3D models on a 2D plane, pretty much. Hmm. So, it's like printing out, uh, it's like printing out a D&D &D map. You put your little buildings and towns and all that. And then you take your character and just you're like a cardboard cutout of a character, 
and just move it across the map. That's pretty much what the game feels like. Oh. So it feels artificial and fake when you push a button and Sonic goes through a loop. You don't do it yourself because the, the modeling wasn't there. Sometimes Sonic won't go through a loop because he doesn't have a high enough speed level. What? What kind of moronic bullshit Stats? is this? Stats? Oh, yeah, because it's Bioware. So it's got to be an stats. RP it, it's an RPG. Ugh. A really crap one. That doesn't sound fun. Maybe, maybe I should try it myself. Hmm. Oh, jeez. Uh, maybe when I pick, maybe uh, when I borrow your copy of the next Let's Play that I'm playing, I'll uh, lend you that, and you can <laughs> see for yourself. I'll speed through it. That way I can give it back to you and say, take your garbage. Oh, you won't need a speed through it. You'll probably give it back after the five minutes I'm there. Hmm. Anyway, back to this game. Okay. Yeah, so, uh, without killing Eggman's ships or just doing whatever Eggman wants you to do, there really is nothing to these levels besides get to the end and get the emerald. Isn't that every Sonic level, though? Get to well, the end? Yeah, but I didn't want to make it that obvious. I mean, I'm giving some hope to these games, okay? Some objectives are easier than others. For example, uh, you could look at this and say, Well, I kind of want to do the neutral, but uh, destroying five ships, that seems a lot easier than destroying however 40 fucking robots he's got, whatever. 40 so, robots, my god. I don't know. Sorry, Eggman. Yeah, see, I do like the idea of not only the branching paths, because that adds to replay replayability, but um, just the little objectives you have to do to get those, those uh, little side parts. I like that. Well, so we're gonna far. we're gonna be having to deal with a lot of these objectives uh, as we do multiple playthroughs. Dude, you're getting killed. Stop, stop getting killed. Shadow does not die. Eggman, shut up. <laughs> I choose my own path, Eggman. Yeah, my own path is predetermined. It goes in a straight line, cause I'm going nowhere with my career. Get straight through your line, head. straight edge. <laughs> <laughs> st uh, straight up edge going in a straight line. Shadow, I'm so sorry that your career is not going anywhere. Hey, we got this game called Sonic Boom. You want to be in that for like five minutes? No drugs, no sex, no alcohol, just guns. I have a desk job when I'm not saving the world. It's really boring, but it pays the bills. Uh, I can't I, tell. Oh, that door is open. I Go away, man. I wear slip-on rocket shoes that I bought from the local Walmart. Again, they get the job done. They sell rocket shoes at Walmart? At least they should. Walmart has everything. Everything. <laughs> oh, no, it's getting stormy. Oh, oh no! Oh. I hope Charmy doesn't fly away and get zapped by lightning. Oh, wait, that was the last level. Crap. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, Charmy's gone, and thankfully we don't have to worry about him. Can, can I still see, like, Charmy in the background getting zapped by lightning? I, th I think that would still be pretty fun. I don't know if I could do that. I mean, that's just... Oh! Yeah, there he goes. Charmy? I can use the control stick to ascend. <laughs> the monster's so, yeah, going, uh, shut up! So, yeah, Shadow's running a dragon. I guess that's kind of cool. Uh, all right. Sure. Is this one of Black Doom's guys? Yeah, but we tamed it. It's kind of hard to control because it's like he has a mind of its own, but you do have some input. It's 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 weird. I don't want him to get hurt, but it's like he wants to get hurt. <laughs> and I, I still love the the thought in my head that Shadow narrates every single thing out loud, so the monsters just thinking. <laughs> Yeah, watch my health bar at the bottom right hand of the screen. I noticed a, ra a ray of... Uh, I noticed a light of ray needs, and then I hit the checkpoint. I, one of those black alien dudes hit me, but I decided to kill him. And then I saw another one with a sword. I took him up before he could even notice what hit him. And then I did some triangle jumps for no reason, because, hey, kind of cool, right? <laughs> He's turning into root letter. <laughs> oh, <Hey. laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, you haven't played that game. You don't know how crap the localization is. <laughs> no, no, no. Is. From your input, that's exactly what was happening there. Yeah, well, yeah. Getting away from I collected the end goal. I ended the level. Here I am at the end goal. Here I am at the end of the level. I've ended the level. Here I am at my ranking of E! E!
I thought I did fine. You should have gotten an F for that. Jeez. E is the lowest, so. Oh, okay. Wait, well, whatever. Yeah. Well, hey, it, we'll see you next time. Let's play Shadow the Hedgehog. I mean, Arr. Hedgehog. I mean, asshole. Whatever. Whatever.